Using sublevels, you can use the level editor to create game worlds. You can also use the level editor to create partial game worlds that you can reuse in other game worlds. Each of these partial game worlds is called a subgame or sublevel. Sublevels allow you to break up large game worlds into smaller pieces so that they're more easily managed. They can also be shared among multiple game designers. To create a sublevel, open the project lister, right click the game item at the top of the project tree, and select Add New Subgame. You're prompted to give the new sublevel a file name. The new sublevel appears in the project lister. The name has an asterisk until you save the main level. All of the objects that you create in the sublevel are saved to the sublevel's file when you save the project. To add an existing sublevel to the current level, open the project lister, right click the game item at the top of the project tree, and select Add Existing Subgame. The sublevel appears, with all of its game assets, in the project lister. Note that the sublevel is placed at the origin of the main level. You can select all of the objects in the sublevel and move them. You can modify the object in the sublevel just as you can any other game object. Any changes you make to the sublevel are saved when you save the main level. For example, you can move objects between sublevels. Select an object in the project lister and drag it to the topmost game objects folder of the level or sublevel that you want to move it to. You can also copy and paste objects from one sublevel to another. These moved or copied objects do not move or change within the design view, but they are saved to different level files when you save the project. 